When Clinton Merritt of Coal Valley returned from his service in Iraq, he realized he had all the symptoms of post-traumatic stress disorder. When he couldn't find enjoyment in his usual hobbies, he took up a brand new one, blacksmithing. TV6's Brad Burton introduces us to this veteran and his craft and how it's helped reshape his life. I would do things that I used to enjoy and it made me sad. Even spending time with my son who was just born, it made me sad. <laughs> and so um, I realized something was wrong with me and I tried getting help and the help didn't help very much. Come on. <laughs> I decided I would try to learn something new, something that was entirely different from all the things that I used to enjoy since those were the things that made me sad. And I thought, blacksmithing's interesting. This is how I reclaimed my mental health and that's what I want to share. And so for them, free classes. Uh, for others that want to learn, I'm more than happy to help. Drawing this out wasn't too hard. So I have setups like this. I have another one in my garage. I have two forges and, and one anvil and a couple of hammers. And so I can get probably four people together and give free classes to military, active and veteran, as well as first responders. I don't have a shop where I can do it, but I'm working with like county fairgrounds or firehouses and I just roll this stuff up, put it out, get about four people at a time right now making stuff. We can make wall hangers and um, bottle openers, some coat hooks, uh, pretty simple things. And then if someone shows the interest and the skill, we can come back for later classes and do more advanced things and just keep working it up until you get into the you know, level that you want to be. Merritt plans to showcase his works at this weekend's Freight House Farmer.